A follow up now on a story we first brought you yesterday. Officials at the University of Rhode Island are calling for more help from the state, claiming the school's facilities, uh, sports facilities, that is, either can't be used to their fullest extent or in such disrepair that they need renovation. And now the university is asking for upwards of $80 million, double what's in the state's budget for the university's athletic facilities. Matt Paddock took a one on one tour with URI Athletic Director Thor Bjorn and joins us now with more. Matt. For athletic director Thor Bjorn, he says it's not about fancy, it's about functionality. And he says with the disrepair at the university sports facilities, it's not only holding back athletics, but it's taking away opportunities for athletes from across our state. The problem is uh, these stands are a real challenge and, um, and need to be replaced. $42 million. That's the asking price to completely tear down and replace the stands at Mead Stadium. With it, building a new press box, concessions, and restrooms. In today's day and age of running a game, is, is not suitable. You just, it doesn't work. You know? um, but what they are not is ADA compliant. Uh, there's no elevator to the press box. Last year, the stands, which can normally seat 4,300 people, were only able to seat 3,000. This is the people of Rhode Island's facility. We want to host every high school championship here. In a statement, the governor's office acknowledges the underinvestment by the state towards URI over the past 50 years, stating there is some money in the governor's next budget to address some of the issues. $43.3 million is recommended for the University of Rhode Island to renovate Mead football stadium stands and Slade track and field. The project to bring an outdoor track and field facility to the school estimated to cost $12 million. We haven't had a track meet here in 30 plus years. The state budget calls for URI to chip in some money here too, nearly $11 million. And all of that money, Bjorn says, wouldn't help improve restrooms and concessions which are needed for softball, baseball, soccer, and track. His proposal? It's probably a place to put concession stands, storage, restrooms that could be used by soccer, track, and softball. The press box is also an issue. According to Bjorn, soccer, softball, and baseball all need updates. We don't have a press box. We have a press lab. Um, that has kept us from hosting, we believe. It's kept us from hosting an NCAA championship. According to Bjorn, the baseball facilities need about $10 million in improvements. Softball, $7 million. The pool, $6 million. And soccer facilities, roughly $4.5 million. Reporting in East Providence, Matt Paddock, 12 News.